This is code.org. Let's see what we got. So far, all the functions have been created at the bottom of your code. What do you think will happen if you call the function before it's defined? Uh, and what that means is before it's defined, this is where it is defined. And also, yeah, uh, okay, right. So this is where a function is defined. We say what the function is, right? We give this box of code. And so look at this. Now they're calling the function underneath. So after all of the functions are made, let's see. Notice that the red square is drawn before its function is created, while the green square after. Which do you think will be drawn? The red square will be drawn, but the green square will not. You cannot call functions after. The green square will be drawn, but the red square will not. Both squares, you can create functions anywhere you in your code you would like. So what's interesting about this, neither is not correct. Uh, is that depending on your programming language, uh, the computer can be very particular about when you draw a function or when you use a function and call its name when you define and call. For instance, in, well, most programming lang languages, C and Java, Visual Basic. So, but the unique thing about JavaScript, which is the language we are learning part of, is that it actually, how it compiles and how it all loads, you should be able to call a function wherever you want because it's gonna load all of the code first and then run it. So it will see the functions even if they're beneath or above them. So, boom. But, uh, onward.